What up guys, I have a packed show for you today with stuff from Adidas, Nike, and Jordan. Some of it classic, some of it brand new. There's just a lot going on this week. Let's start the show. Welcome to the Heat Check. I am your host, Jacques Slade, and let's start the show with stuff that actually dropped yesterday. One of the bigger releases came from Adidas with the drop of the Boost X for Women in the Olive colorway. These are super clean, and those are 200 bucks. Adidas also dropped the Pure Boost DPR and the CB. The DPR came in core black and is gonna cost you 170, while the CB came in core black and night cargo, and those will cost you 170. You can get all of those over at Finish Line right now. On the Nike basketball side of things, we have the LeBron 11 SFG prototype colorway that dropped. This is the pre premium version of the shoe and it's all black and those will cost you 140 if you can find them because they're pretty much sold out everywhere yesterday. All right, moving on to today, we have the Adidas Ultra Boost in the Pride colorway. Adidas actually launched a few of their silhouettes celebrating the LGBTQ community, but Finish Line has the Ultra Boost for $200 if they are still available. Now, on the women's side of releases this weekend, Nike is dropping the beautiful and powerful collection, and it contains quite a few silhouettes that are all dipped in Summit White. Finish Line is actually going to have three pairs from the collection. One is the Blazer Low. That one's going to cost you $100. There's also the Classic Cortez, which is actually making a comeback this week, and those are going to cost you $90. And finally, Finish Line will have the Nike Air Max Jewel, and that one's going to cost you $130. The full collection actually looks pretty clean, and Nike is definitely showing some love for the women with these. Now, on to the Vapor Max Flyknit side of things. Nike is dropping and one of the more colorful collections we've seen of the shoe with the day and night collection. The collection is inspired by the colors of the sky as it progresses from night into the day, and the collection has different looks for both men and women. Finish Line is going to have the full set, which is six, and there's three for men and three for women. Those will cost you $190. If you are a Kevin Durant fan, tomorrow is the day to get your hands on the Steel KD colorway of the KD10. The KD10 is the latest signature sneaker for Kevin Durant, and though the first colorway did launch late last month, the Steel KD colorway seems to be the hero colorway, and that drops tomorrow and those are going to cost you $150. Jumping ahead to Saturday is when the Adidas Originals is getting really serious with their releases. They have the EQT Support ADB for both men and women, dropping from $110. They are really serious, and the men are getting five colorways, and the women are getting three colorways. If you're a fan of the EQT Support, you should definitely be up on these. All right, switching over to Nike Basketball. Nike is set to launch the Kyrie 3 in the Chrome colorway. If you've been looking for a pair of like almost white basketball shoes to rock during the summer at 120, the Kyrie 3 is pretty much the one you need to get. All right, keeping with Nike Basketball, Basketball, they also have the LeBron Soldier 11 in the Court General colorway dropping on Saturday as well. Now this model dropped earlier in the week and in the uh, black colorway, but this time they're going with white and metallic gold. It's going to cost you $130. Now for those good folks over at the Jumpman, they have two releases coming this week. First is the Jordan 31 in the Playoffs colorway. This model is basically black and white and gives you some love on the Jordan 31 in the low cut design. Those will cost you $160. On the retro side of things, Jordan Brand is dropping the Air Jordan 7 in the Pure Platinum colorway. Pure Platinum has been a bit of a theme with Jordan Brand the last couple of weeks, and you can grab those over at Finish Line for $190 on Saturday. As with every week, there may be a few other things dropping, but I just wanted to give you guys the quick highlights of the stuff that I thought you would definitely be paying attention to. As always, I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line, and I appreciate you. Make sure you turn on your notifications and all that for this channel, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace.